So, I am a fourth year student, uh, a medical student at Torrey University. Uh, my undergraduate degree was in psychology and math. So, I really appreciate Holland, Dr. Holland. He comes at medicine from a very basic physics perspective and then extrapolates for, or from a mathematical to physics to biophysics to chemistry uh, to kine uh, kinesiology all the way through psycho uh, psychological and psychospiritual aspects. And he in integrates them all into one model, which from what I understand is his holonomic model. Mm -hmm. uh, and I really appreciate the way that he teaches it. He's a phenomenal teacher. Um, and he breaks it down uh, like, a, like a logical proof almost. Uh, so it starts with basic mathematical principles and then how that mathematics is, is, is um, uh, integrated with physics and then uh, chemistry, biochemistry, how the organism, how the physiology and the organism move um, and how all of the, and then how that intera they interact with their environment. Um, and it's, it's a very complete uh, view of uh, the human organism and their relationships. Uh, so how does that interact with your osteopathic training at Turo so far? So uh, it, is, it is very uh, integrative with the osteopathic principles, mind, body, spirit, uh, uh, and the four, the four principles of osteopathic medicine. Uh, my, my observation has been going through medical school. We're really good at, le at being taught the Western allopathic model and then the osteopathic model or the, the osteopathic manipulation is sort of taught as a separate thing and we're left to our own devices to figure out how they can all be put together. Dr. Holland provides a model where there is no separation. Uh, it's kind of one of those obviously they're, they're, they're uh, integrated, and he does so in a very, very smooth, uh, smooth way. He does his, he, he he does his patient interviews while he's treating them. He sees how their body responds during the conversation, um, and then he's not afraid to order X-rays, MRIs, ultrasounds, uh, blood tests, urine tests, and then he takes all of the data and treats a patient. Uh, using his hands and with whatever medication or supplements are needed. And previously I'd only seen it where the medications or the OMT are seen as kind of like a separate modalities and not as a combined uh, system. Okay, so it's more of a, it's not a really, it's not new information so much as it's a way of looking at information that's already there. Correct, and it's taking all of the data in all fields and putting it into one thing, integrating it is integrated medicine, I guess, is the catchphrase nowadays, but it truly is an integrated model, a holistic, hol holonomic model. All right. <laughs> uh, so uh, going forward, because this is your last day with us here at the Holonomic Institute, uh, what, uh, how are you going to take what you've learned so far going forward? That's a good question. <laughs> I will do my best to digest everything that I learned here, um, and going forward, it's, it sets a framework for how I interact with patients um, and how I uh, conceptualize um, how to care for people um, in all aspects of, of that phrase. All right. Uh, well, thank you so much, Alex. You've been, uh, it's been great having you here, and I'm happy that you've learned a lot of good information with us. Uh, so, yeah, I'm just going to let you go now. And, all right. Thank you very much. All right, bye.